Hey guys, I'm Kennedy Thomason and I'm with International Enrollment and Services. Today, our student spotlight is all about our wonderful student, Rebecca. She's a senior from Australia. Hey guys, I'm Kennedy Thomason and today I'm here with one of our lovely international students. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? Hey guys, my name is Rebecca Olwata. I'm a senior here at ETSU majoring in nursing. I'm East African, so I'm Kenyan and Ugandan, but I was raised in Australia. Perfect. So let's just go ahead and start in on the interview. My first question for you is what all are you involved in on campus? Um, so I'm a part of a few things. I am the College of Nursing Senator for the student SGA. Uh -huh. um, and also I recently started up an organization called The Roots. I'm the co-president and it's basically just an organization for people who are from the diaspora, who are from America or Africa and just want to come together and create a community. Cool. And then you're also Miss Black and Gold yes. for the Alphas, are you not? Yes, so I actually was the reigning Miss Black and Gold for last year and I just recently gave my crown. Mm -hmm. But it was an experience. I got to learn a lot about the Alphas mm -hmm. and what they stand for and it really was a great experience. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you ate that down. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, my second question for you is why did you choose ETSU? Because it's so far away from... Also, it's literally on the other side of the world. Literally on the other side. Um, well, funny question is, I actually have a cousin who was an alumni, alumni here. Oh. Um, he went to college of nursing and he was like, yeah, it's a good program. And, you know, I've lived on the beach. I've lived in the suburbs, in the city. And I'm like, you know what? Let, let's try the mountains. Why not? Okay. Fair and enough. So I applied. I got in. And the program's been pretty good so far. Right. Yeah, cool. Okay. So what has been your biggest culture shock? going from Australia to America? Mm, okay, so I came here maybe four years ago, but in the first time I came here, we went to like a drive through and I was like, I'm get a large, and the large was literally the size of my head. Like portion sizes are massive. I I still can't even get over it. Yeah. But that's probably the biggest thing. Also just so many fast food things that we don't have in Australia. Yeah. Like, I think we only have a Subway, a McDonald's, okay. and a KFC, that's it. Okay, yeah. oh, cool, cool, cool. Mm -hmm. What has been your favorite experience at ETSU so far? Mm, okay. Uh, well, I came here to transfer last year, so I've only been here for almost two years. Okay. But I think my favorite time at ETSU or experiences are like when there's the um, Black History Month. Okay. We always have those events like every month, and they just really showcase like you know Black culture. And yeah. I really love seeing that from just different aspects. Uh -huh. And then that Buck party that we had, Buck Block party. Like, yeah. First, that was yeah, that was a lot of fun. Best thing I've ever been to. It was like college experience yeah. basically okay. Yeah. Cool. okay so what is your favorite place on campus my favorite place would have to be the cult okay. so I actually work at the information station at the cult it's like literally right in the middle and through working there for like the past year I've met a lot of people because I'm a yap but also I'm always certified helping. yappers <laughs> yeah I'm always helping people and then I've gotten to know people from different countries and it's been really cool. Like it's been a really good experience being an international student and just learning more people without having to do too much. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. So my final question for you is what piece of advice would you give to any incoming international students? Okay. I would say take advantage of every opportunity that comes your way, whether it's joining organizations or setting up clubs or even running for SGA because that's something I didn't see myself doing until I did it. Yeah. Um, I feel like and international students experience is always going to be different like from a regular student so might as well make it what you want it to be because you're going to have it probably for another long while so yeah okay. cool well thank you so much for coming today i enjoyed having you yes. if you guys have any questions for either myself or rebecca just hit it in the comments mm -hmm.